House Democrats introduced a bill to update the cutoff date for eligibility for some immigrants to apply for permanent residence. This is not the first time that changes have been made to the Green Card Registry, and the current cuts of date is 1972. Visit us at Southern Region with your questions to see how best you can help you achieve your process. Please don't forget to subscribe if you're new to the channel. Let's get into the video. The 46th House Democrats introduced a bill titled Renewing Immigration Provisions of the Immigration Act of 1929, which could create a path to citizenship for about 8 million documented and undocumented immigrants just by updating the existing registry law. There is no specific date being suggested. Instead, House Democrats are proposing that applicants would have to have lived in the U.S. for seven years to become eligible creating rolling registry that allows new people to apply every year. The registry provision has been updated four times since it was established in 1929. The most recent update came in 1986 during the Reagan administration. Immigrant advocates said the cut-off date for eligibility is too far in the past and the number of eligible applicants has severely dwindled. Between 2015 and 2018, only 305 people applied for permanent residence through the registry, VOA requested U.S. Citizenship and Immigration Services latest data on green card application through registry, and a spokesperson said the information was not readily available. Democrat Representative Zori Lovegreen, the author of the bill, said the registry has been part of the immigration law for almost 100 years. During 2021, negotiations over President Joe Biden's Build Back Better Act. Legislators considered a change in the immigration registry, but the initiative failed in the Senate. George Mario Cabrera, a director of communications of the Coalition for Human Immigration Rights of Los Angeles, said the bill is not amnesty and does not change the law itself. It only amends the color of the system. If the registry bill passes the House, it would need to get three out of five backing in the Senate to reach Biden's desk. It would conceivably be melted with other immigration reform initiatives on Capitol Hill that currently have bipartisan support such as the Farm Workforce Modernization Act, that bill which would provide a path to legal permanent residency for undocumented agricultural workers and their family members, passed in the House and has some Republican support in this night. On Wednesday, Vanessa, now 20, urged legislatures to think differently about immigration, not only as a continual crisis, but as a normal orderly civil process. Updating this registry begin to do that by letting people like me who have lived in and contributed to this country for many years get a green card it is possible if you can get enough people behind this ball we must join to be able to win once and for all i hope you guys found this video extremely helpful if you know anybody that could benefit from this information definitely make sure to share this video with them we are all about empowering you with knowledge so the more people that can benefit from this video the more people will run watching this video if you like this video please make sure to hit that thumbs icon thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe and hit on the notification bell for more immigration updates. Bye!